what's up little art lovers first of all i would like to thank everybody who have given a very positive review on my first art tutorial so thank you very much today we are going to paint these animals the main motive of the tutorial is to enjoy completely don't worry if it doesn't come up uh, the way i paint it's okay just move on okay grab your paint brush and colors let's get started so the materials used are watercolor cakes any drawing paper paint brush and a black gel pen i have used the specific materials you can check in my description box so first we are going to paint the cat so clean your thumb very well and uh, wet the watercolor cake i am going to use a tint color you can use any kind of color whichever you like so i am wetting the watercolor cake with my paint brush and i am dabbing my thumb onto the watercolor cake dab 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 yes here goes my first fingerprint and the second fingerprint so let it get dry so i'm going to take the same color once again for the dog so until this particular fingerprint gets right i'm going to make up a fingerprint for the dog yes the first fingerprint and now the second fingerprint in the same manner vertically holding your finger after the fingerprint is dry just take your gel pen and uh, draw the border for the head of a cat it's a small circle same way you have to draw the outline for the body of the cat bit of oval shape and the ears a triangular shape two spots for the eyes and there comes the nose and the mouth and some whiskers the legs do these two are front legs and here it goes the tail so my left eye is not that proper so i just fixed it up so now wherever the white part is there you just load your paint brush with the same color and just fill it up oh and one more thing is that you know uh, the first fingerprint for these two animals is like a very small fingerprint from your thumb then for the body you have to use the whole finger of the thumb okay so here i filled the white part of the animal a bit to the ears now here is our cat sitting so we'll move on to the next animal that is dog i've taken a bit of black color and with the same brush i am going to move it in a bit of circular manner so that we get some kind of highlight so i'm going to draw the 
outline this one will be the head here goes the ear and the body of the dog these will be the legs here goes the tail of the dog so draw the nose then mouth then tiny eyes a bit of spots here and there near the nose so I find it bit watery so I'm taking the tissue paper and damping it on the nose part yeah now it's okay now I'm loading the brush with the same color and filling the white part of the animal again I am uh, taking the excess water So whenever there is an excess water you can just take the tissue paper and you know just press it gently onto the painting and just remove the excess water. So here again there are lots of water so I am just pressing it to remove it. Ear is getting filled up with the color. Ta da! This is our dog. So we have finished with cat and dog. So our next animal will be pig. Oink 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 oink. So I'm taking a pink color and I'm holding my thumb horizontally. I see a excess of water so I am dabbing it with the tissue paper gently okay. so until the fingerprint is going to get dried I am going to draw legs and here is the tail now I am drawing the ears uh oh oops oops I messed up that's okay inverted triangle okay inverted triangle for the ears for the pig yes the inverted triangle the eyes and here goes the nose inside the nose just draw the two spots and the smiley face as I have messed up with the ears I am going to fill it with the black color you can just leave it like that so inverted triangle now I'm going to draw the outline for the pig and yes just fixing the ear see now it got fixed up right so it's okay to you know uh, if you get messed up in between you can just fix it up so don't worry just go with the flow and uh, now I'm just feeling the white part of the body of the animal a bit of to the tail yes here it is our pig is ready cute little pig oink oink I forgot to draw the inner part of the ear for the dog okay here it goes yeah now it's fine all the three are good all good thumbs up and now I'm going to draw the porcupine so I have taken a dark brown color again the water is excess so I'm just removing it with the help of a tissue paper yeah now it's okay Tap, tap, tap. So I'm drawing the leg for 
the porcupine and a bit of tail nose eyes bit of here and the spines spikes all around the porcupine just see carefully the direction of the spines okay so here it goes our porcupine so we have did so far four animals cat dog pig and porcupine and now we are going to draw the rat squeaky little rat so I've taken the gray color for the fingerprint to draw the rat and now I have drawn the outline eyes nose ears and the tail legs here it is and the inner part of the ear squeaky squeaky rat I'm going to add a bit of pink for the inner part of the ear you can just take an excess of water by the help of the same paintbrush and again I'm going to put a bit of grey to the outer edge of the ear hooray we did it all the five animals cat dog pig porcupine and rat hope you had fun with this tutorial thanks for watching if you have not yet subscribed or new to the channel kindly subscribe to my channel and click the bell notification don't forget to follow and like on instagram and facebook to see my other paintings thank you art hugs and peace namaste